Minecraft glitches that nearly broke the game. Hey crafters, welcome back to Swerve Chunk. There have been 17 major updates throughout the history of Minecraft. Since 2009, there have been so many glitches that we've lost count of them. The glitches were found by gamers and turns out they found some really good ones. Other times, these glitches were just insane. Let's take a look at the best ones on this video. But before that, why not subscribe to the channel? Subscribe and turn on the bell for the latest notifications. Make sure you never miss another video. With that being said, let's jump straight into today's video. Massive TNT Craters If you love blowing huge, gaping holes in your landscapes, then setting up a block of 100x100x100 100 by 100 by 100 TNT and detonating it is some of the most fun you can have in the game. The best way to do this is through a map editing program that allows you to insert blocks directly into the game wherever you like, saving you the time of meticulously building thousands of TNT blocks. Some players even got creative and built an obsidian meteor in the middle of the bottom of the crater, giving it an appearance of an impact zone. Aside from the dramatic effects on the landscape, this trick also has some practical applications. Decimating your terrain in this manner gives you an instant quarry for mining, exposing materials that would usually take much longer to find underground. Fair warning though, setting off this much TNT at once will crash your game. Infinite Dragon Breath and Eggs This glitch is pretty insane. The Dragon's Breath dupe is something very few people know about. When most people fill glass bottles with Dragon Breath, they look down at it, but looking up at the dragon and spamming right click will allow the Dragon Breath to expand and duplicate throughout the entire end island. You therefore get endless bottles of Dragon Breath. As for the Dragon Egg, if you collect the egg and drop it on the torch, you can use an active end portal to get an infinite number of Dragon Eggs and modern versions of the game. By placing fences below the end portal and dropping the egg between six blocks above, it will go through the portal as a block as well as an item. Duplication Glitches When playing Minecraft, you're always looking for ways to cheat the game, and duplication glitches are perhaps the best ones. The current version of Minecraft lets you duplicate any item, resource you want using the anvil tool. To do this, get yourself a completely damaged anvil, the item you want to duplicate in a free slot, and a full inventory of filler blocks. Then, you continually switch out and rename the item until the anvil breaks. Your items can easily get duplicated like this. Dupes in the Nether You probably never realized that there were dupes that can be done in the Nether. In version 1.16, you were able to duplicate any item you wanted by simply using dolphins and nether portals. For these glitches, you had to set up a water streaming flow into a nether portal with a dolphin in it. Then, throw whatever item you want in a shulker box right on the edge of the portal and the dolphin would come and pick it up going into the nether. The original item will be out of the nether world while the duplicate is within the nether where you need to go and collect it. Bet you never knew this trick existed. Minecart Boosters there was a time when the Minecraft world had no access to redstone resources and consequentially no electricity. So, much like the pre-electrification world, players found innovative ways to solve problems without powered means. The interesting thing about this glitch is that it's an example of an exploit that eventually became an integrated part of the official game. In versions before redstone powered mine track was available, players would build short track loops to exponentially build up speed before launching their carts off at a great velocity. Eventually, the redstone wires were integrated to many other useful blocks and tiles, giving players the booster tracks that formerly required a bit of clever exploitation. Similar glitches can still be exploited using boats and slime resources, but are basically obsolete today. Unlimited Oxygen Finally, let's take a look at a classic Minecraft glitch. This glitch is called the Unlimited Oxygen Glitch. The glitch allowed players to breathe infinitely underwater with the use of one simple tool. All that was required was to keep an empty bucket in your inventory, and to then spam click the water in front of you as you traveled through it. The resulting effect was as if you were perpetually bailing out of the water in front of you, as if to create an air pocket over and over again. This is just one of the many physics defying moments from a Minecraft glitch that made the player feel like they were in some Looney Tunes world, where the normal rules didn't apply. Not that anyone expects hyper-realism from Minecraft, but it's definitely a trick that feels like it should not be possible within the limits of the game. These were just a few glitches we decided to share in this video. We'll bring you some more glitches in future videos. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Thanks for watching.